Welcome to 2023 and welcome to a very special weekly update. 2022 is over and to kick off the new year, we asked five experts their best advice for resource investors in the new year. If, if you're tight for cash, the, the easiest thing to, to be doing is, is buying silver kind of on a regular basis. And advice would be know what you're doing. And I think anyone who listens to your show does. You don't have to overdo it. You know, there's a right amount to eat. If you eat too much at Thanksgiving, you actually don't feel as good because you overdid it. So you don't have to overdo it in the precious metals. If you are underweighted, definitely do it. If you're in that decision-making process we talked about earlier and you don't know where to go with your money, parking it in the metals at this point in time, I think is safe. It's, you really got to manage your risk. It's better to miss out on gains, keep your wealth and your lifestyle than it is to worry about missing out on some gains, but actually take a huge loss. And, and people just feel like they need to be in the markets all the time. And it and you generally do, but not in a bear market, not when things are going backwards. It's best to step aside and go do other things with your life than watch your money just vanish before your own eyes. Well, learn how to read and find the signals when a top is occurring. And all of a sudden you increase your net worth over years exponentially. Imagine I think investors need more liquidity in their portfolios, even though the liquidity costs them purchasing power. Uh, having that liquidity will give you the tools to take advantage of illiquidity rather than being taken advantage of.